Hey, it's Kevin here. I get a lot of questions about what kind of chisels I like to use, different types, and why. So let's do a quick little breakdown here. First one is a pointed chisel. And we're going to use this for some more detail work, getting rid of high points, and doing what we need to do to make sure that those pieces fit really nice and tight together. All three of these chisels feature a carbide tip, and it's actually recessed uh, to ensure some long-term use and durability. And yeah, these are basically lifelong tools. Let's look at the next type. This is a tracer. This one has an oval body. Feels really nice in your hand, really comfortable. And we're gonna use this to split some stone. So it has a nice wedge shape at the front. And we're basically gonna use that to gently drive a wedge into whatever stone we're trying to break and get it to split right where we want it. And for some thicker flagstone here, this is a sandstone. We're gonna use a little bit more pressure when we're striking the chisel with a hammer. But we're gonna use the same technique, kind of working our way across, double tapping as we go, and just adding a little bit more pressure to get through that extra thickness until we get the break that we want. Nice detail shot there. And the last type I'm gonna show you here is a specialty pitching tool. And I really love this to make a nice, clean chiseled edge for stair risers and any other sort of visible area that I want nice and smooth and clean, but to still have that sort of more natural chiseled look to it. So show off a bit of the texture of the stone. And, uh, and yeah, I don't mind a little bit of chisel marks on there as well, add some character. So just taking a little bit off at a time, use that square edge to really chop off nice, clean lines in the stone. Okay, let me know what you think. Feel free to leave some comments. And uh, if you're interested in these particular chisels, check out Mycon products. Talk to you soon.